Hey, what's going on, Rogelio? How you doing? Hello, teacher. How are you today? Good, good. How do you feel? How do you feel today? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? How are you today? Fine, thank you. How do you feel? Excellent. What did you do today? What did you do today? I was working all day, teacher. Do you like do you like your job? Yes. What do you do? Um, I was typewriting letter. Oh, nice, nice. Excellent. Okay, guys, in yesterday's class, we looked at the midterm exam. At this moment, does anybody have any questions about listening A, B, C, any questions? D, any questions? E? No, thank you. All right, so in yesterday's class, we looked at the midterm exam. Do you remember? Morena, yes. how did you feel? Uh, we are in the middle of the module. How do you feel in the module right now as far as the activities, the exercises, difficult, hard? How do you feel? Very happy. <laughs> Very happy, teacher. Okay. <laughs> and the activities, the exercises? Como eh, si fueron difíciles. Ajá, si lo sintió difícil, fácil, ah. le gustaron las actividades. Yes, I like activi activities, mm, eh, homework too. Uh -huh. eh, aprendí, eh, aprendido bastante. Ok. Uh -huh. Gracias. All right, thank you, Morena. Uh -huh. Emma, how do you feel the course? Excellent teacher. Um, I learned English very well. Do you like the activities, the videos, the practices, the listening? Yes. Yes, it's right. What topics do you like? Uh, for example, giving directions for me is difficult once in a while. Okay, okay, very good. This is very important information if you travel to a country and they speak English. You can ask for directions. If you are in a new city and you visit a new city, you can always say, excuse me, where is the bank? Excuse me, where is the grocery store? Excuse me, where is the post office? Excuse me, where is the museum? Excuse me, where is the mall? Right, yes. you, you can where, always- Where is the restroom, teacher? Where, is the, the, where <laughs> is the restroom in a restaurant? Good, good, very good. Um, Ana Cecilia, how do you feel the class? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hi, good evening. How are you? I feel great. Uh, uh, difficult. I am difficult. Uh, the lesson, mm -hmm. they give direction mm -hmm. and the audio. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. is uh, almost uh, confusion. Ah, okay. Confusing. 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 Confusing, yes. Because yes, you, you have to review. You have to review. Mm -hmm. Review, review, review. Repetition, repetition, repetition. Yes, because I learn very much. Yes, you got to mm -hmm. practice, 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 practice. Number one is practice. Okay. Yes. yes. Thank you. Thank you. Good job, Anna. 
Ricardo, how are you? How are you, teacher? Very good, very good. Excellent. So we already arrived to the midterm. Uh, how do you feel in the module, the activities, the exercises, the classes, the practices, the listening, the reading, the grammar? How do you feel it? Uh, uh, I feel and I really like the dynamica. Uh, I like very much the section four. Mm -hmm. and, uh, uh, very good. Okay, uh, excellent. Thank you. Thank you. All right, uh, Mayra, how are you? Fine, teacher, and you? Very good. How do you feel today? Um, um, I like um, the portion of place. Okay. Where is the mall? Sorry? Where is the mall? Oh, it's a corner of my and first. Excellent. On the corner of Main and First. Thank you. Eduardo Najarro, how are you? Teacher. How do you feel today? What happened to you yesterday? You were not in class. What happened? Oh, okay. I'm so sorry to hear about your car. Thank you. Okay. All right. Let's continue, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to be looking at section number four. Yes. Are you ready to continue? Any questions about the midterm? No, teacher. No, thank you. Okay. We're going to move forward and we're going to be looking at section number four. Did you have fun? 4.0 lesson objective. By the end of this class, I'm reading guys from this section over here. Right here. Repeat, by the end of this class, by the, By the end, end of, of class, 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 you class. will learn vocabulary. You will learn vocabulary for talking about. For talking about. For talking about things people hate to do. People hate to do. People hate to do. Okay. Al final de esta clase aprenderán vocabulario para hablar sobre las cosas que las personas odian hacer. Vocabulary. Top eight things people have to do. Hi, everyone. No tenemos sonido, teacher. And in line. Two. Thanks. To clean the house. All right, listen and repeat. Number one, stand in line. Stand, stand in, line. Line. Right. in line. So, how do you say odio quedarme parado haciendo fila? Odio. I hate. I 
I hate to stand in line. In line. Okay, the next one. Repeat, do laundry. Do laundry. I hate to do laundry. Laundry. Number three. Don't travel to work. Travel to work. To work. I hate to travel to work. Go to meetings. I hate. I hate. To go to meetings. Meetings. Number five. I love, I love, I love to exercise. Yes. No. I enjoy. Enjoy working in the yard. That's right. Enjoy. I enjoy working in the yard. Yes. I like yeah. to clean my house. I hate to open the mail. Everybody copy the example. Copy, copy, copy the example. Copy the example. Finish. Okay. Yes. All right. Yes. Now let's finish watching the video. No se escucha, teacher. No listen. Early. Oh, really? I don't have to clean the house. Besides putting this vocabulary into practice, I would also like for you to describe what other things you hate to do and why. After you finish this activity, share your work in our discussion forums. So I want you to write five examples here in the discussion forum. You're going to write titulo, activities, and you're going to give me five examples. For example, I love to lift weights. I enjoy cooking. Number three, I like to eat pineapple. I hate to wash the dishes. Number five, I hate to do my homework. Any questions? Did you have any, any question? What is your question? Cuando uso tú y cuando solo pongo el verbo como en acción, como I like to tal cosa o I like dancing. Ah, okay. For example, if you say I like, to dance or I like dancing. Both are acceptable. I hate to cook, 
I hate cooking. Both are acceptable. The action is right now, no to. And no, in this context is not a verb. It's a gerund. Okay, okay. Do you know what is a gerund? The actions? No, no, no. En este caso es un gerundio, no es verbo. Oh, okay, okay. Es considerado nombre. Si tú dices, I like to dance. Aquí de la... O, I like dancing. So, in this context, dancing is not considered a verb. It's considered a gerund, a noun. Okay, hey, teacher, thank you. Okay. Do you understand, guys? Yes, teacher. All right. You will but have... I have a question, teacher. What is your question? What is the mean lift weights? Uh, levantar pesas. Okay, thanks. Yeah. All right, you ready? Practice. Eh, los, las parejas pueden escribir el mismo ejemplo. Pueden compartir su pantalla. Are you ready? Yes. Are you ready? Yes. All right, yes. let's yes. do it. <laughs> Perseverando. <laughs> sí, cabal. En las mismas. En las mismas. En las mismas, perseverando. Tr tratando de aprender. Ay, sí, que... Nos cuesta, ¿verdad? Pero ahí vamos luchando. Sí, ¿verdad? correcto. Correcto, sí. pero lo importante es intentarlo. Ay, sí, así es. Este... Eh, bueno, ¿cuál es, ¿con cuáles empezamos? Este... ¿Qué odio usted? <ríe> ¿Qué odio hacer? Sí, fíjese que yo, los ejemplos que había hecho era I have to travel by bus to work. I, I hate, I hate it. it. Ajá. Esa era okay. la que yo había puesto en mi publicación, ¿verdad? Mm, ok, yo estaba poniendo I hate standing line, eso sí, hacer fila, Ajá. pues. Pero Ajá. que a nadie le gusta. No. I, I hate to the laundry también. Ajá. Lavar. Y bueno, en mi caso, I hate eh, cocinar. Ah, <ríe> eso sí, no, no me gusta. <ríe> Y lavar los Solo platos. Comer menos. <risa> Solo comer. Men. Solo comer. Sí, comer sí. I like. I like. I like. Ah, I bueno, like. en caso voy a poner ahí. Ajá. I hate cook. Ok. ¿Usted ya lo había, lo había hecho en la, en, no, la, no. en la publicación? No, haciéndolo estoy, de hecho. Ah, no, vaya. No lo, ajá. Ah, no, vaya. Les, no lo había hecho. Ajá. ¿Qué ajá. otra cosa puso usted que, que odia? Uh, yo, yo había puesto I wore, espérense. I have a work meeting on the Mondays. It's tedious. Yo tengo mm. una reunión los lunes. Es tediosa. Mm -hmm. Eso quise poner yo. Vea. I have a work meeting on the Mondays. Mm -hmm. It's tedious. Le puse mm -hmm. yo. Ajá. Para variar, ¿verdad? Yo por aprender para, otra palabra. Ajá. Sí, para que no solo sea el hate. Ajá. Y Tedius se escribe T -E Ajá. T D I O S. Ah, okay. Hi. Uh -huh. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. No lo puedo creer que estar en el grupo de Morenita. Hola, Morenita. Sí. ¿Qué tal? Hola, Lexi. Hola. Hi. <ríe> hey, me agarra. Me agarraron en curva, no sé qué es lo que se va a trabajar. Ay, ya, estamos haciendo las oraciones. Estamos eh. haciendo cinco oraciones. Pueden compartir la pantalla ah, para que él vea. Era, 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 que no la Ay, vi a eh. Mayra, hola Mayra. Hola. Ajá, mucho gusto. Un gusto. Oraciones, ¿me dicen? Sí, estamos la... haciendo. Sí, perdón, el 4.1. 
eh, hay que incluir cinco, cinco oraciones. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Eh, de, lo, de lo que no nos gusta hacer, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. O lo que odiamos hacer. Uh -huh. Ok, está bien. Eh, bueno, ¿Ya las armaron o, o hay que elaborarlas? Pues, sí. ajá, ya le habíamos hecho, pero no sé cuál se le ocurre a usted. Por ejemplo, otra vez hemos dicho que hay hate están en line, que es, eh, odiamos hacer fila, ¿verdad? Oh, Cualquier aquí fila, no. a quien no le no lo molesta. Sí. Ajá. Sí. Ajá. Sí. Ajá. Eh, bueno, y en mi caso estaba diciendo que odio, I hate cook, cocinar, porque no me gusta cocinar. Ahí sería, Ajá. I hate to cook, uh, to cook. I hate cooking. Oh, okay. I hate to cook. to cook or I hate, I hate cooking. Okay. Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay. Yo, Yo tengo había una. Puesto... Ah, okay, compártala. Que ver, my daughter practice taekwondo is good exercise. Ay, qué buen ejercicio. Yo había hecho I <coughs> El supermarket, I hate. Creo que no nos gusta a nadie, ¿verdad? Hacer línea en el supermercado. Okay. Esa que ha puesto era una de las mías. Okay. Eh, uh -huh. La persona que está compartiendo la pantalla puede compartir las oraciones para que las vean los demás. Ok. <coughs> Yo, yo tengo otra. I hate to go in the bank. Ah, sí, también. Depende si hay traer dinero, sí. No. <risa> ah, bueno. Con, con, con deja pagar, no. Ajá, pero la mayoría vamos a pagar, no a traer. <risa> sí. Entonces, sí. Entonces sería I hate. Um, ¿Qué? Hola. 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 I hate to go a bank. Ajá. Ajá. Sí, está bien. A bank. No. Sí, está buena esa. No, no. I hate to go to the bank. Okay. I, hate I hate to go to the bank. To the bank. Or okay. I o sea, o sea, love to receive remittances. Teacher, entonces no debe de llevar in the bank. No, to the bank. I Solo hate to go, to go to the bank. I love to receive to the bank. remittances. Oh, okay. okay. Odio remittances. ir al banque, me encanta recibir remesas. Okay. <laughs> Teacher, teacher, I, y en el caso, eh, odio ir a pagar al banco. I ir a pagar. hate to go pay bills to the bank. Bills okay. to the bank. Bills. bills to the bank. Thanks. Pay, ¿cómo se escribe? Pay. ¿Ah? ¿Cómo se escribe pay? Bills. No, no, eh, dijo, I hate to go pay the bills to the bank. The bills the to the bank. ¿Cómo se escribe pay the bill? Pay the bills. Bills. Son okay. recibos, ¿verdad, teacher? That's right. Oh, okay. Entonces, okay. Ta también otra. Ah, oh. dale, está. Diga, diga. Bueno, yo tengo varias, en la, pero no sé si puedo compartir la pantalla. Claro que puede compartir la pantalla. Oh, quiero ver. Ya le salió, ¿verdad? No. De otra forma, eh... de... ya, ya me llamaron. Sí, ya nos llamaron. No, el no, teacher no, está no, con no. nosotros. Por favor. El teacher no. está ahí vigilando ah. de que estemos ah. haciendo las actividades. Ya, teacher, ya terminamos de hacer las actividades. Vamos. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready, teacher. Okay. Yes. 
Pues sí. ¿Cuál es la otra oración que tenía? Me dijo. Ah, yo tengo, I hate to make the bed. I hate uh -huh. to mop the floor. I uh -huh. hate to, to the to the ironing, que era planchar, que dijo usted. Ajá, ajá. I enjoy to, to listen to music pop. I enjoy to run, correct? Uh -huh. I hate to dance. I hate to escape, patinar. Yo, yo tengo, I hate watch Matrix in television. I hate to do laundry every weekend. I hate ironing clothes. I hate travel to work. I hate exercise. I hate standing in line. Y tengo, I enjoy listening music. I enjoy cooking food. Esas son las mías. Eh, teacher, no sé si le podemos preguntar. Oh, creo que ya terminó la sesión. Pero... All right, let me hear, Ricardo, let me hear your examples, please. Okay, uh, I work uh, together with Carlos. Mm -hmm. Y nuestros ejemplos son, I like to visit the mountains. I love being at home with my family. I enjoy going to the park. I hate I hate going to the to the dentist. I hate traffic on the highway. Perfect. Perfect. All right. Select somebody, Ricardo. Uh, ra Raquel Santos. Raquel Santos. Let me hear your examples. Good evening. Good evening. Um, I hate to drive in the traffic. I I like to drink bubble tea. I hate to the to do the dishes oh, and uh, um, I love, I, I don't know if this is correct, but uh, I do it. Mm -hmm. So I love to eat desert. Oh, to okay. Eat desert. That's good. I love to eat desert, donuts, chocolate cake, cookies, cheesecake. Everything, I love it. Me too, pineapple. Everything, everything. Peaches, <laughs> ice cream, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Everything. Mangoes, oh man, I love it. Okay, let's continue okay. because I'm getting hungry. Let's look at 4.2. By the end of this class, you will learn how to form positive and negative statements in the simple past using regular verbs. Additionally, you'll practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Al final de esta clase, ustedes aprenderán a formular oraciones positivas y negativas en pasado simple usando verbos regulares. Además, practicarán una conversación la cual ilustra cómo se utiliza este tema en un escenario de la vida real. Simple statements. Form positive and negative statements in the simple past using regular verbs. Additionally, you'll practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's get started by listening to a conversation titled, I didn't study. Let's listen and practice. 
Hi, Jennifer. Did you have a good weekend? Well, I had a busy weekend, and I feel a little tired today. Really? Why? Well, on Saturday, I exercised in the morning. Then my roommate and I cleaned, did laundry, and shopped. And then I visited my parents. So what did you do on Sunday? I studied for the test all day. Oh, no. Do we have a test today? I didn't study. I just watched television all weekend. Let's get started by practicing these statements in the past. Simple past statements. Regular verbs. I studied on Sunday. I didn't study on Saturday. You watched television. You didn't watch a movie. She stayed home. She didn't stay out. We shopped for groceries. We didn't shop for clothes. They exercised on Saturday. They didn't exercise on Sunday. Didn't equals did not. Spelling. Watch. Watched. W-A-T-C-H-E-D. Exercise. Exercised. E-X-E-R-C-I-S-E-D. Study. Studied. S-T-U-D-I-E-D. Stay. Stayed. S-T-A-Y-E-D. Shop. Shopped. S-H-O-P-P-E-D. Let's analyze the examples on the chart now. I would like to get started with positive statements. Before I start though, I would like to point out the verbs towards the right hand side of the chart. When talking about the past, and if we're using regular verbs, we will follow a quite simple rule. We need to change the verbs to the past tense. And we can do this by simply adding ed. For example, the verb watch. We will change it to the past by simply adding ed. On a different class, we'll learn how to pronounce these verbs and also the spelling rules. Let's go back to making positive statements in the past tense. In order to make positive statements in the past tense, we will follow this formula. Subject plus verb in the past tense plus complement. Let's analyze a couple of examples now. I studied on Sunday. First, we will add the subject I. Next, we will include the verb in the past tense. Finally, we will put a complement on Sunday. Let's analyze one more example now. You watch television. First, we will add the subject you. Then we need to include the verb in the past tense. Finally, we will add the complement television. Let's learn how to make negative statements in the past. In order to make negative statements in the past, we can follow this formula. Subject plus didn't plus verb in the present plus complement. Notice that in this case, we include an auxiliary verb, didn't. And because we have this auxiliary verb, we will no longer change the verb to the past tense. Let's analyze a couple of examples. I didn't study on Saturday. First, we will add the subject I. Next, we will include the auxiliary verb to make negative statements, didn't. After that, we add the verb in the present tense, study. Finally, we will add the complement on Sunday. Let's analyze one last example. You didn't watch a movie. 
first we will add the subject you. Next, we will include the auxiliary verb to make negative statements. Didn't. After that, we add the verb in the present tense. Watch. Finally, we will add the complement a movie. Now it's your turn to practice making positive and negative statements in the past tense. I would like for you to use all the verbs on the right hand side of the chart and provide similar examples about yourself, family, friends, and co-workers. For example, I watch television on Monday. I didn't exercise on Monday. My friend didn't stay home on Saturday. She shopped for clothes. After you finish this activity, share your work in our discussion forums. Okay. For this activity, I want you to give me at least five examples. Five examples. For example, I studied on Friday. You watched the news. We shopped for shoes. They exercised on Monday. You're going to give me at least five examples in the discussion forum. Are you ready? Let's go. I'm ready. Con watch. Eso, eso entendí con los verbos que ya teníamos en la, en la pantalla. No sé si uh -huh. viene. Correct, correct. A la mano, correct. Correct, correct. No sé si usted okay. les tiene a la mano. Sí, con watch. Sí. Uh -huh. Quiere que le comparte. Puede compartir la pantalla. Vaya, entonces en el primero, eh, solo, ¿sería en presente o en pasado? No dijo el teacher, ¿verdad? No, porque están las dos. <coughs> eh, eh, sería el primero, I was, I was to the, I, I watch. I watch. I watch, ajá. I watch. Uh, I watch TV, the... No, a movie. I watch a movie in the cinema. Mm -hmm. Sí. I watch. Y podemos hacer la negativa también <coughs> con watch. <coughs> sí, de una vez. Quedaría I didn't. I didn't watch. Ah, la primera sería, ah, este, le puso la ed, ¿verdad? El verbo. Porque es el, el pasado. Watch, watched. Ajá. Sí, ¿verdad? Ajá. Ajá, pero se dice ah, watched. Pero lo vamos a, lo no. vamos a tomar, lo vamos a tomar, este, sí. Yo no, yo no, ¿Cómo? es decir, yo no vi la película. O, ¿Cómo sería? I watch. Es que vamos a usar el verbo en pasado. Ajá, el ajá, watch. I watch it. Ajá, I, I, ed. ed, ajá. Y la ajá. pronunciación es watched. I watched a movie in the ajá. cinema. Vale, la negativa quedaría I didn't watch. Ahí sí, porque el verbo va en, en presente, ¿verdad? Porque usamos el auxiliar, el didn't. 
I didn't watch. O sea, nosotros no vimos um, TV yesterday at night. Very con exercise. Va a ser usted la de exercise. Vaya, hágala usted y después me la dicta. Voy a hacer la de study. Okay. Hola. Hola, hola, está sola. Hola, sí, es que me desconecté con la compañera Nancy Gutiérrez. ¿Se podrá con ella otra vez? Ok, ok, Nancy Gutiérrez, let me see. You. Thank you. Gracias. Let me see. No veo a Nancy Gutiérrez. Emma, Eduardo, Cecilia, Néstor, Marvin, Carlos, Roxana, Yesenia, Hugo, Ana. René, Rogelio, Alexis, Raquel, Mario, eh, tal vez con Morena, Fuentes. Ajá, y, y Nancy, es que lo que pasa es que se le estaba descargando el teléfono. Y... No, no veo Nancy. ¿Será que se le descargó? Porque lo Puede acababa ser. de poner. Ay, qué lástima. Uh -huh. Ah, pues la voy a poner con Mario y Morena. Ok. Ella compró ropa, ella ya nos llaman, ¿verdad? Ay, yo creo que sí, ya nos están llamando. Pero... Ajá. No, 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 solo trayendo no. a Cecilia ah. Rivas. Ah, ok, ok. okay. Eh, teacher, tengo una consulta. Yes. Eh, el didn't es didn't o didn't. Didn't o didn't. 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 Como que fuera R. Correct. Correct. Didn't. 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 Thank you, teacher. Didn't. Uh -huh. Didn't. Aquí está Cecilia Rivas. Hola, Cecilia. Sí, sí. Hola, sí. hola. <laughs> Voy a escuchar cómo han avanzado. Ay, hoy. <risa> voy a ver así, voy a ver si lo han hecho bien. <risa> Mejor dicho, voy a aprender. Ah, no. Bueno. Sí, Hola, mucho gusto. Aquí. Hola. Hola. Este, Ay, disculpen que mi, tengo problemas con mi Inter, así que por eso decidí no, no tener la cámara. Está bien. Sí. Pero aquí estábamos compartiendo lo que, lo que él ha hecho y lo que yo he hecho aquí en la pantalla está, ¿verdad? Ajá. Y yo estaba leyéndole la 4, she bought clothes yesterday. Ajá. Y la compró ropa ayer, ¿verdad? Ah. Ajá. ¿Usted había hecho alguna? No, no todavía había llegado no. hasta ahí. Ah, no, vaya. es que estaba con una compañera que se le descargó el teléfono. Ah, ya. Vaya, también yo había hecho, ay, cooked orange chicken yesterday. Ah. Yo cociné pollo a la naranja ah. ayer. Pollo a la naranja ayer. Ah, Ajá. Sí. Orange. Ayer ¿Sí? es. Yesterday. 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 Ajá. Uh -huh. Yesterday. Uh -huh. Ajá. Esos son las, mis, mis, mis ejemplos. Ajá. Hay una que se parece, la una que se parece la uno con la que yo había hecho que es I, was, I watched television on three day. Uh -huh. La compañía había hecho I watched television on Monday. On Monday. No sé, nos ah. copiamos los ejemplos sin querer. Ah, está bien. Ay, no, a mí uh -huh. dice me quiero ver, no, no había mucho ninguna. I didn't, ¿qué significa? I didn't. Yo no hago ejercicio ah. los lunes. I didn't. Ah. 
Pues direnk. Con direnk. Hola, Hola, hi. Me salí, no sé cómo y volví a entrar. <risa> No se ande saliendo, pues. No sé qué hice. Sí, yo también me salí, no sé qué pasó. Eh, tenía, no tenía carga en la compu, pero me sacó de todo. Pero... Ah, Así no. pasa. Yo, yo por eso sí. dejé la, de grabar el, el video, perdón, de poner el video, porque lo, no sé qué está pasando. Está bien inestable el internet. Sí, pero bueno. Fíjense que yo hice eh, ese, oraciones en, en el pasado simple y eh, también las hice negativas y las hice este positiva sí uh -huh. ah. pero, afirmativas sí. sí pero igual este, se las quería compartir una que está en corta que es en el pasado simple I studied all afternoon on afternoon ajá como yo estudié toda la tarde I studied all afternoon Ah, sí. Uh -huh. Esa es en, el, en pasado, usando el... E, ah, e, así e, como, e, I sleep uh, on e, after, ¿no? Like <ríe> Ajá, usando el ID. E. Esto no nos va a costar mucho porque en el pasado se usa ID, e. pero ya en los irregulares, sí, ay, no, ahí vamos a memorizar. Sí, porque eso se, se conjugan de otra manera, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Sí, sí. estos son fáciles. Sí, por ejemplo, uh -huh. yo sin querer usé un irregular en la cuatro que yo hice porque en she bought, porque es compró y, y en presente es buy, ¿verdad? B, U, Y, ¿verdad? Buy, ajá. Uh -huh. Ah, en presente. Uh All right, let me have your examples, Emma. Let me hear your examples, Emma. Okay, number one, I watched a movie in the cinema. I didn't watch TV yesterday at night. Continue. Correct. Yes, continue. Okay. I exercise every day. I didn't exercise every day. I studied English for two hours. I didn't study French because it's difficult for me. I stayed in my house on Saturday all day. I didn't stay in a party on Sunday. I shop, shop, chop, chopped, 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 chopped a new, chopped a new pair of shoes. I didn't shop foods for this week. Perfect. Only that. Perfect. Excellent, Emma. Thank you. Uh, Mayra Romero. Hi, teacher. Hello. Let me hear your examples, please. Uh, my mother stayed home today. She chopped ice cream and apple on supermarket. Mm -hmm. and Mauricio did not exercise all week. Excellent. You did not buy the books on Friday. On Friday. Good. On Friday, perdón. I Good. studied all afternoon. Okay, I studied, uh-huh. Okay. All right, very good, Myra, thank you. Ricardo, let me hear your examples. Uh, first, uh, I work on Saturday morning. Mm -hmm. You study, you study on no Sunday. Toda la mm -hmm. She shopped clothes on Sunday, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. stayed in house in the weekend. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We shopped for groceries at the supermarket. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They watched a movies 
at the cinema. At the cinema, very good. Thank you, Ricardo. Eduardo, let me hear your examples. Okay. I exercise every day. Mm -hmm. Oops. I I didn't exercise the last weekend. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I like I like shopping. I like shop shop on the weekends. Mm -hmm. I like to shop on the weekends. I like to shop. Um, I I don't buy I don't buy buy food for this weekend this week. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I stay in my house all all day. Okay. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's continue. We're going to look at the next activity, which is going to be knowledge check instructions. Change the verbs in parentheses to the past to complete the story. You don't need to type a period. It is already placed. For example, on Friday night, I waited for a phone call. You will have five minutes to complete the activity, and then we will check. Let's go. Comparto mi, mi. Comparto su idea. No sé si pueden ver mi. Yes. Sí. sí. Yes. Thank you. Ok. Así sería entonces como me uh -huh. Sí, sí. Así pues, me quedaron. El que me costó fue los negativos, porque uh -huh. se me fue uh -huh. la, el orden, así que. Pero, uh -huh. es, entonces. Miren, como el segundo, ¿verdad? Ya. Que no se puso el contractado. Perdón, Morena. Ajá. Y ese fue el que me costó a mí, que no ah. se ponía el contractado, sino que todo completo. Sí. Entonces, como ya las tenemos, ¿por qué no decimos una cada uno? Sí, me parece. ¿Verdad? Este, sí. Si quieres okay. con el sistema, Mayra. Ok. Uh -huh. On Friday, Friday night, I wait, waited for a phone call. Ok. Sigo yo. Okay. But my girlfriend did not call. Siguiente. Girlfriend. Sí. Uh -huh. Sigo. Sí. I hold, I hold yes. style home and wash out TV. Okay. Uh -huh. ¿Quién sigue? Solo somos tres. No. Sí, está Vamos Nancy también. Acabo, acabo de leer esta, pero si ya. quieren Ah, pues entonces es si falta, ¿verdad? Ok. Eh, on Saturday, I visited, or visited my friend Frank. Eh, uh -huh. Ok. Falta yo. We'll sí. take an listen to music. Music. Esa palabra está mal escrita, ¿verdad? Esa, esa, music. Esa, music está mal escrita. Uh -huh. Moisés, Moisés ahí. Music. Music. Sí, la pronunciación como cuesta, ¿verdad? Es sí. de adaptarse. Sí. Uh -huh. O uno lo dice de una manera y no es manera. Sí. No tiene oído uno todavía para eso. Sí. No. Por ejemplo, la, la, la que sigue, no sé si se dice he invited, en la parte de invitar, ¿verdad? No sé si se dice he invited, no sé si se dice así. Evening, 
In the evening? In the, in the uh -huh. evening, he evening. invited some he friends. He invited some friends over. Over. And we. And we. Entonces, he invited. Así, invited, ¿verdad? Invited. Invited. Algo así. Invited. Sí. Cook and greet me. Y cook. 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 Como que se hubiera maturado. Es que es más fácil. Cool. Sí. Sí. Bueno, este, si quieren leo la, la siguiente, la de I, I, I did, I not, did work. not work very hard I on did. Sunday. Yeah. Uh -huh. La que I, sí. I did not study at all. Bye. Y allí estoy, no sé si se dice study o no. Study. 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 Está, está study. presente, study. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Es que está presente. Mm -hmm. I did not study, porque como estamos hablando del pasado, tenemos el did not, did not, did not. Mm -hmm. did not. Mm -hmm. Es cierto. Mm -hmm. Bye. La que sí. I just walk. Es el que me tocaría. Perdón, solo tengo una duda. Entonces, ¿cuándo se dice study? Es que es, study es cuando está en presente. Study es presente. Ajá. Ajá, y ya cuando le agregamos en la ED es cuando está solo en pasado, pero no se usa el did, del did, no. Did, no, no se usa. Mm. Ahí le pondríamos el ED en pasado, solo al verbo. Ah, ok. Ajá. Pero cuando agregamos la, esta contracción del did, did not, Ahí sí usamos en presente el verbo. Sí, ya entendí. Uh -huh. Gracias, ok. Uh -huh. Ay, ¿Quién lee la última? Ay. A ver, eh, voy a leer. I just, no sé si, se, eh, si me pueden por favor corregir. I just uh -huh. walked to the mall and shopped. Hasta ahí termina, ¿verdad? I just sí. walked. Pero bueno. Lo bueno que terminamos. All right, let's check. Number two, Ricardo. Num number two, didn't call. Excellent, didn't call. Number three, Stephanie Mejia. Okay. I can hear me. Yes, I can hear you. Watch it. Very good. Watched. The next one, please, Maida. Uh, bis, eh, toda la oración. On yeah, Saturday. You, yes. Okay. On sat, Saturday, I visit my friend Frank. Excellent. Visited. On Saturday, I visited my friend Frank. Very good. The next one, Morena. Morena, we can't hear you. We, we talk and listen to music. Perfect. Uh -huh. Continue, please, Emma. Teacher, music has been written mal in the anterior. Perdón? Music está escrito mal en la pregunta. ¿Por qué? Como es music, music dice. Music eh. debe de ser. En, to music. Music. Tell, um, music dice. Listen to music. Pero no dice music. No dice muy, dice muy. Music. Ah, muy. Es francés. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm going to okay. report that. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to fix it. In the evening, he invited some friends over and we cook, cooked a great meal. Perfect. Thank you. Ana Cecilia. Work every hard, every, very hard on Sunday. Thank you, correct. Eduardo, the next one. Good 
Did not start. Hi. Two All right, Cecilia Romero, the next one. Uh, teacher, esta sí me salió mala porque yo le puse not work it, pero me queda, Ay, me sí, queda sí. mala. Okay, so I good. didn't study at all. Thank you. Alexis, the last one. I uh, use uh, Chappelle Walk. I just walked to the mall on the shop. Uh -huh. Very good. I just walked to the mall and shop. Perfect. All right, ladies and gentlemen, time's up. And we will see you tomorrow. Please continue working on the platform. Good night. Okay. Bye, teacher. Good night. Bye, teacher. Good night. Good night.